welcome to my little corner where there is no wrong way to play with paper. I hope you're having a very, very blessed day. Thanks for being here. We're doing another 31 days of cut files with my crafty friend MK from Some Assemblage Required, along with many other <laughs> talented, I cannot even begin to tell you, talented creators. Now you can check out what everyone else is doing with the same cut files that you see me using, either by clicking that playlist where you can click it and it's in the description of this video and you can see see other videos of um, MK and others who are also doing videos with the 31 days of cut files or you can join the Facebook group that is literally called 31 days of cut files and you can see the posts and everything that everyone is um, sharing to be inspired and figure out how you might use them if you want to know where to get the cut files that's in the description and with that let's just start a new week of cut files so Pear Tree is where they, this week's cut files are from. We're doing this one today, and let's just get into it. All right, so it is a movie reel, okay? And it says snap. Let me get all my ducks in a row here. It says snap. I don't think I'm gonna use this snap because I really wanna use this popcorn paper from the Simple Stories Family Fun line. I have used this line. I have purchased this collection, not once, not twice three times. I use it a lot. I really do. I don't know if you guys have ever seen that line, but definitely you can get it at your favorite place to shop. Um, really good um, photos for game night, movie night, going to um, like go-kart parks and, and all of that kind of stuff, stuff that you do out on outings, and we all take photos. I wish another line would come out of this. So, if you know of another line, because I have used this so much, I'm kind of tired of using it if I'm being honest. If you know another line that is geared toward family game night, would you put it in the comments? I would be grateful because I would love a different set of papers. I mean, I'll still use these, don't get me wrong, but I would love a different set of papers. And um, so anyway, I need to, I'm just gonna start at the very beginning today. Usually I have a base ready, but I think I just want this one sheet of paper. So I'm gonna cut off the branding strip and then place my cut file. The photo that I'm doing today is of Junior at the Despicable Me, I believe it was Despicable Me 2 um, movie premiere. He was so excited, so excited to go to this movie. <laughs> He's so cute, isn't he cute? And so I wanna trim this down. I really don't like the um, movie theater, you know, that ugly carpet that they have. So I'm gonna trim it down to a size that I like. Let's see if we can get a four by four out of this because at the top, no, it's gonna be a little bit more than a four by four, but you know what? That's okay because it is my only photo, so I'm not gonna stress about it. There we go. Now I need to, there's a gal standing here. We don't need her. We don't need her. Um, when you have a single photo layout, do not stress that it's a particular size. It's the only photo on the whole 12 by 12 page. So go to town with it and just make it what you want it to be. Right? I mean, there's no rules, no rules. Let's see, well this, I have this scrap sitting here. I'm gonna map this. I know I wanna do that. And yes, this is how I do Here's it. There's my photo, there's my cut file. And then from there, all I've done is grab a bunch of ephemera from swaps, of course. I do have some 40 and mark, nine and market film strips. Um, I have this ticket. This was made by Nadine um, all the way from Canada. She is one of our um, beautiful swap captains. If you guys wanna swap embellishments, come on over to Ginger's Corner, hang out with us over on Facebook. We would love to have you there. Okay, so there's that. Then, I don't necessarily want snap to be my title. I honestly thought about coloring this cut file and I'm like, no, the white pops on here. So I really like that. This was made by Deanna for the Say Cheese Swap. How cute are these? And I think what I'm going to do, I don't know if it'll fit yet. You can tell I'm still taking out the package. Oh, it does fit. It'll fit enough. Nobody will know the difference. I'm okay with that. Okay, so that is gonna be my title because <laughs> you might not be able to see his smile from 
there right this second when I do close-ups you probably will he is ear to ear smiling right now like <laughs> he's the happiest little monkey okay and then I have this beautiful embellishment it was made by Lynn um she it she actually has um a YouTube channel it's called LV crafts so we're gonna take that okay and let's see here how can we I'm just gonna make a cluster so what I'm gonna do, nothing too fancy. Hmm, how can I, wonder if I could go like this even. Oh yeah, I like that, say cheese. Okay, I'm almost thinking I need to map this, pull out a couple papers from this line and map this like two or three times. Maybe, maybe, maybe. What else do I got here? Then I also have a camera and I don't know who made this, but I'm thinking, of maybe putting it down here like so even like weaving it in there I do like that maybe we'll marinate on that for a minute we might not because I could just put I still can put a journaling block here we'll see I don't know let's see what else I got I thought I had a little something else over here but oh here we go oh the director's chair that's kind of cute hmm Maybe, I don't know about this. I wonder if I were to just put this over this. Oh yeah, I like that. I do, I like that. Okay, and I think I need some stars. So maybe I should grab out some wood veneer stars. I love the popcorn. Maybe even have this come this way so more of my real shows. I like that, got the tickets. I'm not sold on this yet. Could I maybe even go like so? I could go like this and move the ticket that way. There we go. We definitely wanted to say ticket. Say cheese. I kind of like that more. See, just got to trial and error stuff. That's all we got to do. Um, Let's see if we can't use some of these 40 and 9 and market film strips and call it a day. I don't know. We'll see. I have these in almost every single color and I never use them. So I've been trying to pull them out and use them. I think I want a smaller one for sure. I could go, whoops, these little centers pop out of here. I love these, you guys. They are just so unique and 49 to market this year has just been knocking it out of the park, right? They really, really have. Okay, let's see if we can't slide that one there, okay? And then put a really big one on this side. Sure we can, we can do whatever we want. All right, so see if I can slide it without making a mess here. Just going, oh, maybe. Let's see, let's see. Look at that. Oh, so instead of, now I'm gonna bring it down, just a hair. And then, yep, definitely. I do want to map this in different colors. So here's what I'm going to do. I am going, obviously this needs to be back on top of that like so okay what I am going to do is I'm going to create a small journal block for right here and then I will map this on different in different colors papers that coordinate with this line because I have all kinds of scraps um set aside for that so I think that's what I'm going to do I'm kind of wanting maybe to put the year but I could put that in my journal too I think that'll work you guys, how cute is that? How fast was that? And you know what? I used the cut file. I did use Bot Ephemera from the 49 and Market. Um, you can buy these scrapbook.com, scrapbook generations, cherry on top. Um, they're just called the essential film strips. Wherever you like to shop and you earn your points, go. They are a lot of fun. And they make the tape as well. That's a lot of fun. Speaking of tape, I bought this tape on Timu. And I could maybe... Oh no, I ha I like it like this. I don't want to start messing with it. <laughs> I'll ruin it, right? But I do have this for future reference, for sure. Okay, the only other thing I'm gonna do is I want some stars and I'm gonna use these wood veneer ones that I got from Timu and maybe a couple different sizes instead of enamel dots, I'm gonna use the stars. So let me map this at least two more times, maybe in a red, hmm, 
I don't know, maybe black even? I think that might pop, but either way, I'm gonna mat this at least one more time, maybe two, um, with coordinating papers. I think I am going to put the stars down and I am gonna make the journal block and I'll come back with a finished page. I can't believe how fast I came. You guys, I literally just sat down here 10 minutes ago and I just kind of went through my red binder and I found this and I found this and I had the cut file and I thought, Oh, and I found this because I had this in my red binder. And I thought, mm, I should get the film strips. Got the film strips, tossed it on all in here, and I started filming. <laughs> so, talk about a quick page. That was pretty quick. All right, so I'll be right back. I'm going to stop yakking. And I'll talk about whatever I do different. You guys know how that works. <laughs> I'll be right back. All right, you guys. I got it all glued down. I added my little journaling block. I did add a little sticker. It says, it's showtime. This was a scrap I found. <laughs> When I was looking for my papers to back here, I backed this in the same star paper and red. These are just papers from this um, line from uh, Simple Stories. And I just, the, oh, I inked the edges. I guess I did do something a little bit different. I'll put close-ups. You guys, thanks for hanging out with me. This was a fast one. This is another reason I love swapping embellishments with my friends because you know what? It just made the page happen. It, it was bada bing, bada boom. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys, be blessed. I'll see you tomorrow and bye.